Hey, what's up? Good morning, you guys. Happy Saturday. Welcome to our morning news edition to preview the Jets Packers this afternoon. How you doing this morning, brother? I'm good, but that wave of emotion that I was experienced last Saturday for me came crashing down. I believe it was Thursday afternoon with the news of Carl Lawson. You know, kick my ass, will you? I mean, holy <laughs> crap. <laughs> yeah. It never freaking ends with this team. Yeah. It never freaking ends. But like, I, I mean, like the, the best pass rusher we've probably had in 10 years or more, if yeah. not 20. Yeah. Sure enough. For me with John Abrams, I felt like I was being body blowed by Rocky Balboa. I was sucker punched. I lost the wind in my, in my, beneath my wings. <laughs> it was just, it, it was just terrible news. But I'm sorry, Kev, me and you as Jet fans, and I know there are some older Jet fans out there, maybe some younger Jets out there, that this is the curse we talk about, you know, having potential and losing Testa Verde, having potential and losing a Pennington, having a potential and the mud bowl, like all these things seem to just, you know. Gassino and, Gassino and Kozar in Cleveland. Yeah. It, 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 on and on and on and on and on. Yeah. Stupid little things or these injuries that just the cloud stays with us. No matter what we try to do, the cloud stays with us. Eight and three with Favre, and he blows the shoulder out. It, it yeah. just, I, I mean, come on, yeah. man. And I know injuries happen in football, but for this organization, they happen too much when we're riding the wave, when we're on and, this. And, and, and to crucial people at crucial times. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. And you can, and listen, we know you can't tell a player, whoa, only practice 50%. No, you can't tell a player to slow up. That's how you get injured. You have to play full mm -hmm. war. You practice. You got to do your thing. And I mean, and, I don't know how he got injured. I mean, I yeah. know it was during practice, but. Yep, pop the Achilles. Everyone knew it right away. Oh, now, yeah. If we are looking for some positive, Salah has dealt with this before in last year with the 49ers. I feel like the 49ers lost half their starting defense, and I believe they were still a top 10, top 15 defense, with half the starters gone. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. in that hey, case... Hey, this is going to be the test, man. Yeah, Huff, Franklin Myers, Step up, next man up. Well, yeah, I mean that leads me to my first point here about nope. the game. I mean, who's gonna, who's gonna re life after Carl? Who's gonna replace him? Huff? Yeah, yeah. You know who's gonna step up? Do we go free agency? Do we do we do a trade? Do we stay mm -hmm. in house? What do we do? Yeah, I, I, and I think I think these next two preseason games are going to tell the Jet thing, you know, they're going to go bring in another free agent to help, maybe an answer. And I'm, you know? and, I, and I mean, what if somebody else goes down? Yeah. Yeah. Now, I understand we're deep and everyone's talking about deep, 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 deep. You know, I get it. But, you know, we're down the best cog. We're down our biggest impact on our right. deal. Right. You know, the rankings and, and, and the Vinnie Curry's, they were supposed to just be fill-ins. Yes, now, rotation rotationers. Yes, I, that 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 could be a weak link. You know, I don't know. I'm just saying. I'm just putting it out there. You know, and not that what's out there, Kevin, is great, but adding another piece like an Ansa or a Dion Jordan, maybe the not the greatest of numbers, but just another piece to help out. You know. Well, I heard, I, I saw an interesting thing about a trade. Uh, do you give the Cardinals a call about Chandler Jones? I mean, he's, th he's 31 years old, but hey. Depending on what they want. I'm not willing to give right. up a no, sure. no, 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 no. no. want to fleece us, Kevin, because what are we talking about next year? Two first rounders again, two second rounders, you know? Mm -hmm. But, mm -hmm. I mean, we'll see. We're going to know more tonight, and we're going to know next Friday when we play the Eagles how that's going to look. And we're going to yeah, see I mean, go from there. Hopefully somebody steps up. I mean, I yeah. I think we mentioned last weekend uh, about Huff, mm -hmm. okay, that that he looked good coming off the edge and everything. Yeah. So, well, he's he's going to have to, you know, he wants to play. He 
to have to play well tonight. He, the job is all mm-hmm. his now. Yeah. So it's what we got, you know? I mean, and, and, another, and another thing to watch tonight is the O-line because all I've read all week is how the O-line's getting blown up by the Packers. Yeah. yeah. Blown up. Yeah, I heard that too. Yeah. I heard that too. I heard yep. that too. You know? And, 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 and they're going to play all their backups tonight, the Packers. Yeah. So, I, so, I, I, so, if this, so if this offensive line still struggles this afternoon, we got problems. Yeah, agree. Mm-hmm. Agree. And listen, I, again, people, we know it's practice, but we're getting closer to game time. And That's something right. Click now. This team has to start to gel a little more. You know, let, let's not start saying, oh, it's – and listen, I'm guilty of it. Let's not keep saying practice, but we have to start to see something. You know what? Yeah, we, it's, 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 almost, it's almost go time. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Come on. How does tonight have to – and even though it's against this, uh, uh, the backups, our starters, if they're going to be worth their salt, have to manhandle these backups tonight. It should be men playing that's, boys. That's, that's, that's what I'm saying because everything I read – and I even watched some of it. They got mm-hmm. abused. They got abused. Yeah. The old line got abused by the Packers D. Yeah. Yep. yep. So there, and, there's. And I also saw like if they were counting interceptions, like or sa- sacks rather, because yeah. they don't actually let you sack the quarterback in these yeah. joint practices. But they said over the two practices of the two days, Potentially, Wilson was sacked twelve times. Twelve. Okay, the last I heard was six, but again, I didn't read on vacation. I didn't read too much, yeah. so I'm gonna first, twelve. Yeah. Wow, over the two. <laughs> yeah, that's incredible. That's twelve. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Although I will say that Zach Wilson threw that nice dime to Braxton Berrios. Yes, he was, did. Did you see that? Yes. Very pretty to look at, you know? And that's what I want to see tonight. I want to see more cohesiveness. You know, I want to see I want to see Zach even go a half if he can, and then see Mike and Morgan and, do and, this. And, 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 and let's see some long balls. Yeah. I, I, I'm, my eyes tonight will be on when Mims gets into the game and when P. Ryan gets into the game. Mm-hmm. I'm hearing mm-hmm. a lot of other, other – uh, I'm hearing a lot of things about P. Ryan – People could take him or leave him. I think the kid is awesome. I don't yes. know why. Yes. Like, I want this kid to make the team. I think we didn't see what he could potentially be because Gase was just hand it to Gore, hand it to Gore, hand it to Gore. Yeah, get, I, a, get him his Hall of Fame yards or whatever. Yeah. yeah. I'm looking forward to like, I'm, I'm not down on P. Ryan. Like, I'm going to be probably upset if he doesn't make this team, but that's just me, you know? But so I'm looking for Mims and P. Ryan to play well tonight and yep. a little more peace in this, a little more speed to the offense and and the defense to keep continuing to play fast. And I mean, running back wise, I, I like Josh Johnson, man. Or not Josh Johnson. Um, I, at, um, I know who you mean. I can't think of the name Johnson. Yeah. And then there's Ty Coleman, which will play tonight. Yeah. And there's okay. Adam. Yes, well, that Josh Adams. That's who. I, that's who I was trying to think of. Yeah, I I think we have a nice running back class. I think they're going to keep four running backs. I think they'll keep four. I heard something yesterday about them keeping three. Okay, we'll, we'll see. So, which, I, I mean, which, he kind of hinted at that, Salah. So, okay, so keeping three and just cutting one, or looking to trade one. They didn't say. Mm. They didn't say. All right. Uh, an- another thing to watch, I think, tonight is the tight ends. Oof. Yeah, exactly. It's like, I, can I, somebody can somebody step up? Cross, I'm, Herndon, anybody? Yeah. And Kevin, Kenny Yaboa against the Giants had a chance to shine and steal this job. And what did mm-hmm. he do? He mm-hmm. boxed the catch, which caused the fumble, which caused the Giants to score. You know? Yep, yep, yep. And another thing I read this morning was that the whole coaching staff offensively, Uh they want him to get rid of the ball quicker. And that, and that's where I saw that potentially the Packers sacked them 12 times over the two days. Yeah. Some of that was the offensive line I I read. And some of it was him 
holding the ball too long. So. Yeah. Yeah, but that 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 quarterback clock will get better the more he does it. In Absolutely. My oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I and agree. Listen, they know more than me. So by me saying what I'm going to say, people could say, what do you know? And it's true. What do I know? I'm not too worried. I'd be more worried if he's doing that where he's patting the ball three or four times. Like, yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah, yeah. Where do I go? Where do I go? Yeah, the, the, the dancing feet as we're here on the happy mm-hmm. feet. He doesn't seem to have that. So I think that clock in his head will get a little quicker and he'll start, you know, three second boom, two second boom, you know? But we'll, I'm see, not, well, we'll, see, we'll see tonight. Maybe they say yeah. to him, listen, two, two, three step drop and let it fly. Yeah. So we'll see. It'll be interesting. It'll be interesting. I'm looking forward to it. 4.30 yeah. start. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. 4.30 start. Yep. Now, does that mean it's national? I mean, I know it's on NFL Network, but is it like on one of the national networks? NBC, well, ABC, CBS? I don't know. You know, I never got a chance last week to throw a little rant out there about that because before I left, I set my, my DVR to record these games. So I recorded the Giant game. And although I got a chance to watch the Giant game here, which was surprising, I was looking for the Jet Packer game. And Channel 4, because of the golf, is only playing the second half of the Jet game. What? Yeah. I was looking at my guide because if you have direct TV, if anyone don't know, and I'm sure all the, the cable networks now, the, where you could set your thing a week, two weeks in advance. Yeah, sure, yeah. I went to look for the Jet game on my local two, four, and seven, two, four, and five. And I noticed four was playing the game, but the starting time they had was six o'clock, ending at 7 30. So then I went to look at ESPN and the NFL network, and the NFL network is carrying it at 4 30. Yeah. Now, I don't know. Break into the golf. Which wow. I- so what, what are they going to, it's, it's like the hiding game. What are they going to yeah. join in progress? Yeah, I, I guess. I don't know. I'll be interested to turn my set on at six and just, I mean, flick over to N- the N- uh, NBC at six to see what they're doing. But yeah, I'm just gonna stick with the NFL network and watch it, you know? Yeah, absolutely. So, I mean, that's about it for me. Yeah, still. yeah we'll, see. Just, we'll see what happens tonight. Yeah, we'll remind everyone we are on tomorrow doing the full show. Yes, we are, which you are, and a, and a full review of the game this afternoon. Yeah. So. We hope you'll tune back in. And yeah. Before, you know, I was thinking Jets Packers, Jets Packers, Jets Packers. I said, what do I remember about Jets Packers? I remember a game in December of 2002. Okay. We needed this game to win the AFC East. Okay. And in a 42 17 route led by Mr. Chad Pennington and Curtis Martin. We accomplished our goal. <laughs> yeah. So being as though this is Packers week, I figured I'd, you know. Very nice. Was, the Packers allowed this to take place. So very nice. Very nice. So that's brother. about it. That's about it today, brother. Yeah. Yeah. We'll look forward to tonight and hopefully Hell yeah. the glasses from the table go to my hand. <laughs> <laughs> Well, yeah, we said if we win next week, they're going to be in your hand, right? So that's uh, right. That's pretty good, man. All right. So, hey, enjoy the rest of your vacation. Thank you. You as well. Enjoy Enjoy the game this afternoon. You guys enjoy the game this afternoon, too. Let us know what you think in the comments down below. All right. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Sound good? Yep. Sounds good. All right, brother. I'll talk to you guys later. See you all later. Jet up. (laughs) Enjoy the game. You too.